you're looking at right now is the first boss unit ever to be seen in Ravenfield. This thing is even worse than the aircraft carrier. In terms of sheer power, it's able to just keep spawning stealth bomber drone aircraft. But just how many stealth drones can this boss aircraft carrier produce? Well, take a look at this. This is what we're up against. This is the sheer power of the Air Force. Now, we've got these really, really cool little cinematics, and I don't think this is going to go too well, but we're going to be taking out the bomber right off the bat, because what we're going to have to use, outside of running over my own teammates, is a coordinated effort by the entirety of the air forces of the Eagle Nation here, from three different aircraft carriers, well, two in that island. How are we getting locked onto already? And look in the top middle. The LCS-3 Vanguard has one million hit points talk about a boss fight something is jeez where did that missile come from so looking at the map i'm not even like mostly the way there this isn't gonna work out too well is it Ooh. <laughs> and the drones are gonna just ram into you if they can't destroy you we've tried the bomber and we got shot down i feel like a y-wing going on a death star attack run we're already getting missile locked we need something stealth These things are deadly. I think it's clear that the first thing we need to do is take out as much of the enemy drones as possible. And then after that, we should, at least intelligence is saying, we should gain access to a very, very powerful weapon system. So we're gonna use the Hydra. This thing locks onto enemies and fires like six rockets at a time. Now, obviously the enemy has countermeasures. So, Come on. Oh man, they got pretty good evasive maneuvering too. These things are incredibly difficult to destroy. Come on. There's no way you can dodge all of those. Yes, we disabled one. The amount of rockets I've fired just to hit one so far. Eagle flight, our electronic strikes have been activated. Enemy drone swarms and destroy weapons have been deactivated? You're kidding me. We did it? So between me on the ground and just numerous planes in the air, we've gained access to an electronic strike. Attention all troops, attack the enemy destroyers. They have destroyers now? Oh God. Nope, that's my plane, buddy. <laughs> all right, it doesn't look like they're very good at locking on anymore. We definitely have the warning clacks on going, but there haven't been any locks in. Oh, just there. Look at that. You can see the enemy Vanguard warship. The first boss in Ravenfield. All right. So I only have rocket pods and my auto cannons, but hopefully that's going to be enough. Ooh. Okay. I think it was the drones that were coming after me. We're going to do a flyby here. We're going to accelerate a little bit and try to get a better view at this thing. Look at that. A bomber just went down. They've got multiple weapon systems. All right, our first hit didn't do a whole lot. Countermeasures dropped, reloading. We need to have a much bigger and better strafing run. Jeez. Oh. All right. We got targeted by the enemy warship. Here we are in need of parachuting out because otherwise you're going to break your back from G-forces. Who's this guy? Attention, all enemy equipment has been restored. Get ready. Jeez. Oh, this is bad. Getting up in the air is just too dangerous right now. I'm trying to focus down this one. I feel like you need to fire at least three or four rounds of hydras at them before you even get a hit. And focusing on a single one allows you essentially to like hit them, hopefully. Look at the speed they have. They're literally out, out flying missiles. What kind of technology does that thing have? Can I hit it? You know what, let's try this. You can't block this, can you? Watch their health. Is it gonna go down once these hit? They are still traveling. <laughs> it didn't do a whole lot, but it did something. One of the other things we can do is take off from an aircraft carrier, which is, when looking at the map, strategically further away from the enemy warship. 
I really wish we could do a pair drop onto the enemy warship and take it over, because that's honestly one of the best and most effective ways of taking over an aircraft carrier, at least in traditional Ravenfield. Please don't run me over. Oh God, we're getting bombed on the deck. Look at this. Jeez. Okay, this is absolutely absurd. You can get locked on back here. We disabled the MQ-101. Our electronic strikes have been activated. Enemy drone swarms and destroyers, but we're already dead. <laughs> All Eagle pilots are going on an attack run. <laughs> you can see the warship is actually turning around. I'm not saying this is gonna work. All I'm saying is I hope that it works. But if their missile systems are down, judging by the fact that they can't get a consistent reading on us, a consistent lock, we can probably hit them across the broadside with bombs. And we're just gonna have to do this a few more times, I think. Man, this is really making me wish we had that nuclear ballistic submarine that we used in the last video. Bombs away. Come on, give me some good hits. Uh-oh. Well, I mean, when it's that big, it's hard to miss, right? Now, 972,000 hit points. There has to be a better way. All right, bombs along the deck. 957,000. So it, it seems we get, what, 50,000 a bombing run? Uh-oh. They got him back. You know what? Let's try this. Oh, my God. We couldn't even get... Did you see how many missiles just started firing? No wonder we couldn't get so close. I'm trying to see a drone, but a lot of them are just running into our aircraft. And if you could modify your planes, like, look at this. That's a friendly pilot. He's already shot down right above our carrier. Nothing in this airspace is safe. Oh my gosh, they are far too maneuverable. Yeah, we haven't tried a destroyer yet. That might be a better way to do this. Oh my god, we already got hit. Electronic strikes have been deactivated. All right, I'm gonna need a gunner, please. I'm getting wrecked by something. Oh my goodness. I just need to get close enough to do artillery strikes. So Eagle Flights are trying to get in close. We need submarines, man. But the amount of time it's gonna take to get there is considerably longer. Here we go. We're getting some main gunnery hits. Oh my God. And we're dead? Unbelieving the real <laughs> Steel Raven is out there. These drones are impossible. We're gonna have to drop the bombs now. Because we're already going down. Let's see if I can't lock on with this. I can't lock on. You know what we could try using? Is maybe the alien railgun. Alien technology could work. Attention all, enemy is equipped. All right, restored, huh? We'll use a little bit different of a tactic here. We just gotta watch out for those artillery barrages. Like this is a greater threat than the secret Ravenfield UFO ever was. We're getting hits though. And let's see, 199 goes down to. We get about 2,000 hit points off. This is only gonna take like years. <laughs> oh my god. This is what looking at the apocalypse is like. Can we dodge it? I don't think we can dodge it. No, it's it's like seeking on me. This is a nightmare. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. We did evade it though. So we're doing about what? 2000 damage, right? Divided by 2000. This is how many shots it would take. 452 shots with the alien blaster. That's, that's obscene. Wait a minute. I know what we can do. Oh, there's a drone that crashed right on their airfield. We need to study it and start manufacturing it. Now, this is one of the classic old... My God, look at the speed of that drone. Ravenfield weapons. But can it hit them? We're too far away from the action. All right, anti-aircraft guy, you and me. We're going to do this. Just apparently not very well. Oh, there's one down. Oh, there's another. Why aren't you firing? Yeah, these things are just so dang maneuverable and fast and incredibly powerful. 
Oh Come on! He's almost dead. I think I just got killed by friendly fire. We just gotta get a bomber and go on a run. Oh my god. This bomber's destroyed. That bomber's destroyed. Where? I need a new plane! Give me a new plane! Thank you. All right, let's go. The ship is like right there. I need to get just like a tank. All right, here we go. And it's nice and close, but it is moving. So right now we like, you know what? I gotta try it. I gotta try landing on it. Nope. Killed by Archer. Okay, it's got some kind of a force field because you just can't get too close to it. All right, let's get a closer view at these auto cannons. I've dropped a parachute. I might actually be able to land on this. Nope, you get killed by this guy named Archer. He just like shoots you magically. Just try to sneak in an attack run here. It says their defense measures up, but they haven't gotten a lock on me yet. Oh, got a lock. Wait a minute. It says I'm looking right at it. Did it cloak? Either the ship cloaked or it went underwater. Where is it? I don't see it anywhere. Let's see if we go under the water if we can see it. Uh, this is not good. Look, you can see the enemy or a friendly aircraft here. Oh my goodness. Uh, <laughs> I think we're definitely dealing with an alien. How did it get back there? What is going on? Let's get the Hydra. <laughs> it's still able to fire? This is unbelievable. All right, if I look out this porthole, I should be able to see it. Oh, yeah. Let's just try this. We'll throw ammunition. We're kind of protected from aerial barrages. And they can't unlock my missiles here. This might be the best way. Oh, yeah, they're definitely trying to hit us. Jeez. How many missiles was that? A thousand? A hundred? Okay, they can hit us, but I think it's clear that whatever we want to do it will take us either an insane amount of time We're gonna have to use either some modded weapons or some crazy modern weapons or nuclear powered devices If we want to actually destroy this boss ship So if you guys want to see me take another crack at it, well, let me know Thank you for watching pull the trigger on the like button if you did enjoy the video. I'll see you in the next one